Okay, guys. So I'm looking at um, at what this is a, a new Mar, right? New Mar Canyon. Twenty. Thirty nine fourteen. Twenty fifteen. Correct. Oh, 2015. 2015 Neymar, Neymar, and that's on a Ford chassis. You can see here, guys, this is the cockpit. Very nice. Very pretty. And Dave and Katie are going to give us a tour today, so we'll just let them take it away. Okay, so here we are in our living room. This was one of the deciding factors. Um, one of the things we really love about this coach is the L-shaped couch, which kind of closes in the living room, makes it a nice little comfy space here, um, and this will decompress itself when we travel, so that slides in, and um, then over here we have this nice recliner chair and our fireplace and TV area, and um, we really like that. You have your settings for your so, electric heat. So yeah, so heat will actually come out of there, and it is um, pretty warm. So very nice. That's this very is nice. one of the things we really love the floor plan of this coach. Um, we added this little ottoman thing. We have two, but we're traveling now, so the other one's away. But um, matches the furniture. Gives you a little bit more storage too. And more storage in there, absolutely. And we got all this storage. Newmar does a good job with storage. We have three cabinets up here, and then across the way over there we have storage. Um, so we actually have more open space then we have stuff to put in it because we have to watch our weight. That's one of the um, bigger things. Dave knows all about the weight stuff. I don't know, but I know we have to watch our weight. And then over here is our little dining room and our buffet table. And um, this area is nice. They say four people can sit at this table, but it's kind of, we did on Christmas. We had Christmas dinner. We had another couple over and we were all at the table. It was a little cozy. Um, but this slides in to give us more room. But um, Dave has his little computer area over here and um, makes it a real nice area. So we like that. And then one of the things we love about this coach that we was a non-negotiable that we definitely needed to have was a residential fridge. Um, we did not want the Dometic fridge. And um, so we really like this. And the freezer down below, we have ice and water here and um, makes it really, really nice and then our food pantry is here which originally I wasn't too thrilled with because I was like oh this is so such a weird kind of space for um, a pantry it was so shallow but um it ends up working out pretty nicely I don't have too many bad things to say about that and then our kitchen is here um, propane stove and we have convection microwave oven um, Dave does most of the cooking. I'm really blessed. I don't <laughs> have to um, do a lot of cooking. Counter space is limited, but not terrible. I mean, we have enough of space here. So when we travel, this whole slide goes down from the other end of the couch to right here. And this whole slide comes into right over half of the sink here. So when we're traveling, we have a great setup. We can get to our microwave, we can get to our sink, we can get to our refrigerator. Very so good. Um, we can do everything while we travel. The only thing we can't get to is our food cabinet. So we have to plan ahead. To your pantry, um, yeah. We take our snacks out and put them up over the couch. Mm -hmm. But um, that's really the only thing. So we really like it. And then we have, you know, down there. Can't get into it. Lots of good it. storage in your kitchen. We nice. Do. It's nice and spacious. And all these, well, yeah. Have our bathroom I'll just let you go in there Patrick and show our um, sink and our shower very nice mm -hmm. this is what I call my bathroom this mm -hmm. is my bathroom because we have two different um, medicine cabinets so I keep all of my stuff in here and Dave keeps all, all his, his stuff, stuff in there in here with the smelly toilet <laughs> so. I think all RV toilets are smelly yeah so um, <laughs> That is our bathroom area. It works out pretty well. And then back to the bedroom. Our bed. Now one of the downfalls like of this too. coach nice. that we do not like is the, how the bed is on a slide. So when we're traveling and we're staying at a rest stop or travel plaza or something, you know, just a quick overnight, we can't open this slide. So this bed is 
smushed up to the wall, to the closet here, and we can't get it down. So I sleep long ways on the bed, and Dave sleeps on the couch. This yeah. is neat. Yeah. Well, thank Very you cool. for the inside tour. Yeah. Dave, mm -hmm. you want to give me an outside tour? I can do that. All right, let's head outside. It is a 2015 New Marquette in Star. It is the floor plan uh, model 3914. And of course, we have a love for Notre Dame. <laughs> yes, Katie uh, actually went to St. Mary's and she played in the Notre Dame marching band for four years. Really? That's neat. So yes, she got to march on the field and on all the football games and everything. So it's really exciting for that. Anyways, it is running on the uh, Ford 2600 our 26,000 pound chassis uh, with the Ford V10. It is a five speech transmission. It does have the uh, 22.5 tires on. Here is the uh, one of those little monitors for the tire pressure system that I talked about on my uh, channel earlier. So if anybody is uh, you know wondering about that, it's really nice. This is our current map, which we get to fill in some more here eventually. Yeah, you do. That's great, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Awesome. So, yeah. So anyways, a lot of storage, and I'm sorry, it, they're all locked up. Most of them. It's okay. So we'll find the ones that are, but any, that are going to fill open. And inside, you got storage down below. Those first two, one is the um, propane tank, and the next one is the generator. The third one and the fourth one is a pass-through storage. Wow. Okay. Passer. This tank right here, there's a little bit of storage on the side, but there is also the water tank right here. This is where all the business happens, right here. And I still do not understand why our dear manufacturers have your fresh water right next to your dirty water. Yeah. <laughs> Probably because that's where all the hookups are. Yeah, so you got to be obviously meticulous on how you do certain things right. you know, like when I hook up I always hook up the fresh water side first and then I will do the the sewage side vice versa yep this comes off first and then that right and it's all stored separately so anyways very nice so there you go there's a little tiny compartment here good your level okay and it is a pass-through up on top too oh wow yeah Compartment oh, nice. here. There's a pass-through up on top. That's where we have most of our wow. chairs and our table and stuff. This right here, if you can see that little black box right there, that is the. Um, okay, so this little black box right here. Yeah. That is the surge protector, and here is a must-have little gadget for most RVers. Yeah. And that is your nice. pressure regulator. Very nice. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Nice tandem toe, man. Tandem toe. And I've seen the people that you videoed the yeah. last time. Yeah. And I'm so sorry. I forget their names. But they Mike had tandem Don. toe. They yes. do, yeah. And I'm like, oh, yes, another fellow tandem toe yep. person. And and every place I go, I get so much attention. I get more attention for this toe dolly than I do my for the bike. My bike, yeah. And the bike's beautiful, <laughs> by the way. Love well, the this. The first part is, is when you put covers on I did it to my Harley. I put yeah. a cover on it. And with the wind flapping on it, yeah, it actually ruins your, your clear coat. Oh. So anyways, so nice, yep, this nice, is it. It's, nice tandem it's, toe. It's fun. Of course, we just pull a light, a little, whoops, sorry, a, a little, little light sole. Um, sole, light car. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Canyon Star. Canyon Star. Very Ooh. nice. Look how pretty the profile on this The wind guard, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Lots of storage here. Man, lots of storage. That's really cool. There's our Look at Sam. that, Samson. That's, That's really nice. Me. Yes, we had a lady paint that for us at our first RV park that we went to. How cool. Mm -hmm. Get to meet all kinds of neat people. Wow. Motorcycle stuff and whatnot. That's yep. wonderful. And here's our uh, black tank. Yeah. Painted black. So anyway, and then the rest of it are, is locked up right now. But it is the whole... Um, all storage, every last little bit of it. I put up top here a, uh, a light. If you can see that, the LED light, and we can make it like any color we want, like for Christmas we had it. Yeah, color. very nice. So it was really, uh, it's really nice. It really sets the mood, especially when you're sitting outside. Sure it does, that's great. 
is our entertainment system. Oh, wow. Look at that. We have a TV. Well, Dave, thank you so much for giving us a tour of your new Mar. Yes, Patrick. This is welcome. an absolutely beautiful coach. Canyon Star. So, all right, guys. Well, listen, safe travels. So thank glad you. that we were able to meet up here at the RV park here in Southern Alabama. So you guys take good care, okay?